Hello YouTubers, it's Michelle and I am here today to do a grocery haul. This is from our neighborhood Walmart store. Um, we just had one open just right across the street from where I live actually on Wednesday. And if you're not familiar with the neighborhood Walmart stores, they're just a smaller version of a Walmart and it's just uh, basically the grocery department. And of course they do have aisles for like beauty products, um, dog, um, food and things like that and your paper products and stuff but they do not have like a clothing um area or anything like uh, for housewares or anything like that just basically your typical grocery store but um they have like your typical also um prices that your local walmart store would have too on their groceries and stuff so a really nice store we went there wednesday when they opened and it was really really nice um, all the aisles were stocked really well and stuff and then I went over there today to grab some items and it looked like a tornado had went through the store you would have thought that it was the end of the world and their prices were not any better than you know like I said than regular Walmart but um just looked awful uh so many bare eye our aisles and stuff as a matter of fact they didn't have some of the stuff that I needed just to make you know tacos which is what I'm making tonight and um so uh my friend's going to stop and get the extra few ingredients that I need to finish up and stuff. But anyway, tonight we're going to have tacos. Um, I have a friend coming over and we're going to make tacos. And then we're also going to make um, a recipe that I've seen from Lala, Lily Bug Lane. And I'll have her link down below. Um, it's called a Jimmy Dean Sausage Dip uh, recipe and I'm gonna try that out because it looked really really yummy and I know it's not good you know if you're watching your you know calories and stuff like that but I've been doing pretty good this month and stuff and so it'll be all right to splurge just a little so I'm gonna show you my receipts first and um, the first one is this one here hopefully that'll focus a total and then the second one is right here it's not gonna focus so there we go so put this back over here looks like the total on my first one was 26.65 and the other one is $3.69. And the reason why I have two receipts is because I forgot some stuff and had to go back in and get a couple of things that I would forgot. So like I said, we're going to have tacos tonight. Um, first of all, though, what I did pick up was the Walmart. And this is their brand of the light banana strawberry yogurt. And I really like that. Uh, flavor. I've never tried the Walmart brand, so I'm not sure, but um, I've tried Kroger's brand, and I've tried, you know, Yoplait and stuff that pretty much tastes the same, so I figured this will. But this is the four pack, and let's see if I can see on here what the prices are of this stuff. Let's see. Da -da 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 Looks like it was a dollar seventy seven. Yeah, I think it was a dollar seventy seven for a four pack. Um, then right here I got the Ortega taco seasoning sauce. That was oh, that's on the other. That's one of the things that I forgot. That was seventy three cents. I bought. A two liter of Mountain Dew, and yes, I said in my previous videos that I've given up soft drinks, but I do have a craving here and there for Mountain Dew, so I went ahead and picked this one up. And I thought when I have a craving, I can just you know pour me just a a little bit in a glass, and maybe that'll soothe my craving. Then we have the Dull Light Sour Cream, and that was a dollar ninety eight. 
Then we have the Fiesta blend cheese. And this has your mozzarella, your quesadilla, and Colby Jack all blended together. That was... That was two forty seven. Then we have the crispy crowns, which was the other thing that I had forgot. And I like to eat these on my tacos. They're kind of like um, they're not like a tater tot because I do not like tater tots, but they're really really good if you like potatoes, like in your burritos and stuff like that. Um, these were two ninety six. Then I got two things of the ground beef pound each. And those ended up being. Two ninety six for each of those. So that's all the ingredients that I need for the tacos. The only thing that I'm missing is the flour tortilla shells and the salsa or the sauce. And my friends bringing those, so because um, they did not have that. So that's all I need for that. And then I bought four packs of the Philadelphia cream cheese. That ended up being. $2.97 for each pack. You need four blocks of those for the dip. I bought some Rotel green, or green chilies and tomatoes. That was uh, $0.98. Cents. And then the last thing that I bought was a package of the scoops. And they were... two ninety eight. So that's it. So that is my haul. Not bad. And usually if I make tacos for myself, it'll last me for like two, two, three days. But since I have friends coming over tonight, um, I probably will not have leftovers for tomorrow. But uh, not bad. And I cannot wait to try out this dip. Uh, like I said, I will have Lala's... Uh, channel down below i'll have the link to her dip recipe and if uh, you're intrigued you can try it the only thing that i don't have that goes in that is the actual sausage and you use um the breakfast sausage by jimmy dean and the regular brand so they did not have that so my friend's picking that up so that's it i hope you enjoy this is my first uh grocery video that I did uh, that I've done and um, hopefully you guys will like and I will do some more thanks for watching have a great day bye bye